Yo, what's going on guys? Faze Boost here, and we're on episode 3 of the Modern Warfare 2 Let's Play. I think this is actually, uh... Oh boy, this is a fucked up mission. Oh shit, guys, this is no Russian. This is actually, uh... It's kind of a fucked up mission. I'm gonna have to... Oh, oh hey. Hey guys, it's Velvet here. <laughs> Stuck my way into the Let's Play. No, but, uh, seriously, uh, Phase Booze has got to do the rest of this, so I'm just going to shut the fuck up. I need a little bit of a break. I'm sorry. Uh, I'm just pressing start. Let me drink some of this liquid cocaine. Alright, that changed me back into Phase Booze. It was Dr. Pepper, if you're wondering, by the way. It's not liquid cocaine. I'm, I'm only about that koosh life. I don't, I don't do cocaine. That's fucked up. But, you know, if you like cocaine, whatever. Uh, I'm not going to shoot these guys. That's pretty fucked up. This is a very controversial mission, if you guys were wondering, uh, pretty, pretty fucking, uh, pretty dark of Call of Duty, honestly, uh. So if you guys are wondering, I'm just gonna break it down. These guys are a bunch of fucking assholes, and, uh, I'm in the CIA, and uh, they just brutally murdered everyone, like all these Americans at the airport. Now, I'm sure if you're not American, you're probably laughing your ass off right now, like, <laughs> yeah, that's my laugh. I just, I don't actually laugh. I don't, I don't enjoy things, but. <laughs> just imagine if that was someone's laugh. Get his ass. Come on, put him out of his misery. That's just wrong. I'll do it. Yeah, I also got some uh, underwear and some water. You're not supposed to be taking water on the flights? Jeez. But, uh, no, seriously, these are four Russian guys, and, uh, they're just gonna be shooting all these Americans at the airport. And, uh,. I'm a CIA guy and I'm undercover, and I, uh, I really, uh, don't have to shoot them and I'm not going to if I can help it, but, yeah, I'm just gonna be walking very slowly while these motherfuckers, uh, ruin everyone's day. It's pretty fucking depressing, honestly. This mission is, uh, it's actually a, a skippable mission. You don't have to play through it to get through the campaign, but I really like the books that are here. What to see in Germany. Yeah, they, they sell a lot of these copies, as you can see. It's a bestseller. It got uh, the Nobel Peace Prize and Oprah's sticker of approval, so... It's definitely a really good read. What do we have here in the fiction section? We have The Sign of Four. A Midsummer Nugget's Dream. Does that say Nuggets? I can't really tell. Oh, A Midsummer Night's Dream. And uh, Little Dorrit. Who the fuck is Dorrit? 10% off? Yeah, no wonder it's 10% off. No one gives a fuck about Dorrit. But yeah, I mean, this is a pretty, uh, this is a pretty nice airport. I mean, they're fucking destroying it and ruining it and killing everyone inside of it, but they have Cherbini's, uh, Eiffel Towers. It's a pretty good, uh, Eiffel Tower restaurant. Uh, they have Burger Town, which is personally where I like to get the Koosh Burger over there. As you can see, it's packed with Koosh. Uh, we also have, that's it. Um, yeah, let's go to the elevator. Oh, never mind, they fucking destroyed it. Yep, you broke the elevator. Way to fucking go, Makarov, dick. It's a good thing he can't hear me, though, because if he did, he probably wouldn't want me around. He'd probably just kill me. So I'm just gonna lay off on the insults and just pretend to run, as you can see. This is really awkward. Like, seriously, why would it pretend to run? Just, we're, we're going the same speed, just let us walk. This is really fucked up. It's hard to believe that half of the Infinity Ward that made Call of Duty Ghost and Modern Warfare 3 made this game too, you know? Oh, they're all delayed. I wonder what happened. Welcome aboard. No liquids, gels, or aerosols. Well, it doesn't say no, but it's implied. Sure thing, dick. Look how they run down here. This is fucking great. I want to watch them run. Watch them walk down the stairs. <laughs> I don't know. I just think it looks pretty, uh, looks pretty crazy. All right, let's push up. Yes, I see them. Makarov's so tactical. Oh, this part's fucking insane. Watch this. Where's the cave? Little prick from Call of Duty 4. Look at all those riot shields. 
It almost looks like me and my squad when we're playing Search and Destroy. Oh, the grenade launcher, of course. Thanks for recommending the noob tube. Totally didn't ruin the multiplayer. Pretty sure anyone who plays the campaign and plays this, they're just like, Oh, the grenade launcher is really good. I used it a lot in campaign. Let's just use it the entire time I play online. Nah, that's probably not what ruined it. If you guys are curious, I don't know if anyone is curious, but... Modern Warfare 2's multiplayer kind of went down the shitter uh, around, a, I want to say, like, late December, early January, because there were some, uh, there were some crazy mods going on where there was unlimited ammo and unlimited killstreak ammo and especially unlimited grenade launchers and all this crazy stuff. There was, uh, 18-man rust, free-for-all. It was absolutely insane. Oh, my gosh. I'm trying to explain something. Jeez. Well, and I hit a shitty checkpoint, too. This sucks. But, uh, but yeah, basically, Modern Warfare 2 was completely hacked. At least the multiplayer was. And, uh, it was pretty unplayable, but it's also, it's kind of super fun. But people started realizing how good grenade launchers were, and they just kind of said, fuck it. So if anyone was ever wondering why grenade launchers were so popular, I mean, yeah, they were always pretty good. No one knew to really use them as much until the, uh, the unlimited hacks were going around, and then... Kind of just clicked in people's brains. They're like, oh shit, this is pretty good. This is crazy. Look at all these campers. Oh, I missed the TAR-21. It's one of my favorite guns. It has the Mars sight. What the fuck killed me? Exploding vehicle? Well, maybe you shouldn't park your cars right there. It's fucked up, guys. My fucking... My second fuck up. This is making me really sad. Bum me out. Just gonna noob tube the airplane. See if it explodes. I'm pretty sure it won't, but. It's worth a. Wait, let's shoot that truck. Oh, well, no fucking shit. Sorry, guys. I'm very rusty with this campaign. It's not one that I really played all that much. I might have played it at least, like, two or three times, but that, th that was years ago. This is an old campaign. This is like 2009, 2010 stuff. And uh, it's 2015 right now. We have. We have a lot more swag now. We have next generation graphics, next generation dedicated servers, next generation target enhancing sites, which are personally my favorite. Oh, let's get that fucking van over there. Sweet, triple kill. Yeah, that's going to my montage. Wait, what the fuck? They didn't die. There we go. Oh, shit. It's like my first six in one YouTube. Oh, I don't have the tar anymore. That's pretty shitty. Watch what happens when you kill Makarov. Traitor! Watch this. You can kill his you can kill his buddies. Oh wait, all of his buddies died. Oh, it's just Makarov. 1v1 me Makarov, you little bitch. Let's fucking go. You don't got shit on me. FaZe Boo's gonna destroy This motherfucker. Oh my gosh. Well, I blew. What the fuck? This is my checkpoint? This is outrageous! I just did- Oh my fucking- Yeah, I'm gonna have to bust out the M240. This is not making me happy. I'm so sorry, guys. No more fucking around. I won't shoot Makarov anymore. He is a little prick, though. I want to see if I could kill him, but it's not possible. Alright, let's get that tar. It's funny how it's just right back there, you know? Alright, hopefully that car is blown up this time. Fuck that up again. I wonder if that golf car will blow up. Let's find out. Oh. Gotta shoot that van. Get the multi kill. Uh, a little late. Fucking. I'm so sorry, guys. So scrubby today. If I accidentally noob tube Makarov, I swear to God. If I would have tubed him, I would have cried. Alright, no fuck-ups. Let's just do what we need to do. Let's go. What the fuck? Alright, sweet. Oh, sweet! We can get some med packs. We can get some band-aids for my toes. They're a little bruised from walking all over the airport. I'm holding my fire. Oh, Magrub, you fucking prick! This is a message. The Americans thought he could deceive us. When they find us by, all of Russia will cry for war. 
God damn. Just think how fucked up and controversial this game would be if it was released now. Talking about Russia crying for war. Well, that's Modern Warfare 2 for you. Anyway, hope you guys enjoyed episode 3 of the Let's Play, and phase boost. We'll see you guys later.